what's up everybody it's me your girl the Chinese drama addict and I am back at you with another video this time I'm going to be doing a video of my top picks for sexy Asian drama male actors and baby we got some on the list so with no further ado let's get it going first up we have Mr. Chen Kung with his fine magnificent ass baby he can sing he can act he is a total package and I loved him in Painted Skin, Snow Girl, and the biggest one I loved him in was The Rise of the Phoenixes uh, with Miss Nene. Baby, this man is, I, I, he just did something to me in Rise of the Phoenix. And look at this picture, y'all. Baby! <laughs> Girl, could you imagine a man looking at you like that on a Friday night? I'm sorry. Let's keep 100, ladies. Yeah, I know if it's my ass, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be taking a walk of shame, honey. Yep, that's going to be me, and I ain't going to be ashamed about it. There he is as Nay Ying in The Rise of Phoenix, and baby, is that... And his front lace is on point. And now we have Ethan Wan with his fine Scorpio-licious ass. Damn! God damn, they making him like that over Taiwan? Look at that little tattoo on his belly. Talking about which. Is it which way you want me to go? What you, what you trying to do? I know where I'm trying to go, Mr. Ethan. God damn. You're hurting him like that? Oh, wow. This boy, I absolutely love him. He is super sexy. He's got that Scorpio thing, and he don't got to do much at all. It just comes off on him, period. And the piece that I liked him most in is The Legend of Fayo. Uh, he was magnificent. I, I absolutely adored him in this first uh, costume drama that he was in. And this Taiwanian boy, he getting it, honey. Uh, he, could, he could get it. <laughs> and baby, this bathroom scene in Legend of Fei Hu, I'm sorry. I don't know why she was trying to act like she was trying to get them cookies. Because I was like, y'all here, girl, get them cookies. Quit playing. Quit playing, Fei Yo. You know you want them cookies. Oh my goodness, this was a very good and sexy drama uh, for anybody that watched this. I honestly, check it out. It's on Netflix. Check it out. You will not regret it. One of the best dramas that I have seen him in. Next up, we have Mr. Mark Chow. With, he's Mr. Classy, okay? He is serving us some serious Asian Richard Gere realness, all right? Man, this guy, he really got on uh, he got on the mark. Well, he got his mark set when he did um Eternal Love as uh the as two characters actually, um Moham and um Moham and Yahe and baby I loved both characters he played. Honestly, I would have picked Moham because he's more up my alley. I like I like strict Silent type men that that's just that's just intense in their own strange little way. But baby, these front laces in this were to die for. Okay, women, I'm telling you, you got to watch Asian dramas to get your understanding of front lace artistry. Okay, all right, get that front lace artistry down. All right, because these boys, these boys' lace fronts are tight. And if your shit is looking like the uh, lady on uh, two seats down from you on Sunday who's wearing her wig backwards, back, put, take that thing on, put it back in the bag, and back away from the counter at the beauty supply store, honey. Stop it. You playing. Leave it alone. Go get you, watch some Asian dramas first. Then we can talk. Okay. Next, we are having coming up. Mr. I can't pronounce his name. Don't even try to play with me. Y'all know I murder names. But this is our lovely emperor and baby. He's tall. That boy's 6'4". Ooh, 6'4". Fine as hell. He has been quite a few uh, dramas, but the drama that he's mainly known for is being an internal love and internal love of a dream as our emperor. And baby, yes, he is conceited, arrogant, absolutely gorgeous tall drink of lemonade and bitch you know your ass is thirsty so come get it <laughs> honey i loved him in this if he was a real guy i would be totally head over heels for him 
he this this actual role was made for him and he looks good in that white hair honey and i'm sorry I, if i was his girlfriend i'd be like could you put on the white hair because <laughs> he went on the white hair tonight baby please <laughs> moving right along we are getting ready to go over to mr um mr yeah gone who the great lonely goblin man i'm sorry i'm sorry the gr the goblin the lonely guy he has a way about him that i i that i like too he's been in a, quite a few movies and he's done some risque stuff girl he he was naked on one a movie and i was like totally there watching uh, but he is cute and he is cute in another way he has uh, a strong sexy um strong silent type but in this particular drama he was on point with the fashions i mean he had amazing i loved him he was just so intense but yet uh he encompassed he literally drew you into his role and he does that in everything he actually acts in and i love him as an actor and to me he is very hot and he looks good in his clothes baby each and every time so uh yes you need to check him out i think you would adore him and as a roll up as i wrap this all up for you guys sexy comes in all different ages and races and when you see handsome men handsome men tell them you know these guys are the whole package and their acting abilities are superb they deserve the spots that they have on my list as far as i'm concerned they are amazing and i'm gonna be honest with you i don't have a problem with telling fine men they fine first of all um Fine is not an area of discriminating. Fine is fine. And and baby, I'm I'm sorry. So please don't come on my channel and tell me, oh, she's praising a lot of Asian guys. That's not the point. I praise men, period, that look damn good and they worthy of that. If you look good, this 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 chick right here gonna tell you, you fine as hell. I might not stop and keep talking to you, but I'm gonna tell you, you fine. You fine. You look, you look like a biscuit on a Sunday morning and a bitch is hungry. <laughs> but that's the end of my show today. And um, I hope you guys like this. And I hope you guys continue to watch my show and definitely tune in. Please like, subscribe. And I hope you gave a couple of laughs during this lockdown. Take care, everybody. Bye.